Welcome to Headline News 24/7. Please click like and subscribe. Viewers floored by what happened after Fox News host ate steak in front of ultra-liberal vegan. Jesse Waters had some fun when he invited a doctoral candidate on his show to debate her about the effects of eating meat. His guest was Anne Lasio Parson and she's a candidate for getting her PhD candidate at Penn State. Her big thing? She thought that eating meat reinforced gender stereotypes. Sounds pretty stupid, right? Don't worry, it gets better. The thought was that eating meat supports a hegemonic masculinity or a meat-centric culture but that's also fairly unintelligent, right? It is because men and women both enjoy eating meat products and no one really looks at another man or woman and thinks anything different of them, of course, unless you're a liberal with some strange identity problem. Usually what happens is a man and woman decide what they want to eat and no one else really cares unless they're eating monkey brains or something totally exotic that's out of the norm. If a girl wants a double cheeseburger or a salad, then more power to them. If a guy wants to chomp a steak or have a milkshake, then more power to him. No one cares. Either way, eating meat somehow became the topic of this bizarre woman who doesn't seem to be the best product of Penn State. She's certainly a better representative than Jerry Sandusky, but that's not very hard to do. They then talked about doing vegetarianism and delinking meat from gender hegemony and all I could think of was who cares? Not me. I'm pretty sure no one living their life in any state of normalcy would care about the nonsense that this lady is spewing. Here's where it gets even better. Jesse Waters ate a steak right in front of her. Boom. Absolutely hilarious and if it's cooked any more than medium rare, then he better send it back. What's better than that? The fact that it was recorded. Watch the Jesse Waters steak video below, then tilt your head back and laugh. Just remember folks, eat whatever you want. No one cares. It's your life and your belly. Eat whatever makes you happy, but not so much that it makes you an obese Trump-hating complainer like Michael Moore. Fox News, Jesse Waters on Saturday debated a doctoral candidate from Penn State University, who contended that eating meat reinforces gender stereotypes. As FoxNews.com reported, Anne Alasio Parson published an article in the Journal of Feminist Geography after studying Argentina's meat-centric culture. An academic journal has published an article by a Ph.D. candidate at Pennsylvania State University that argues eating meat maintains a society where hegemonic masculinity is the norm. I contend that in such a context, we cannot separate the ways people do vegetarianism from how they do gender, and Alessio Parson wrote. Doing vegetarianism in interactions drives social change, contributing to the delinking of meat from gender hegemony and revealing the resisting and reworking of gender in food spaces. Delisio Parson theorizes that being a vegetarian in the South American nation is a political act that contributes to the destabilization of the gender binary, or the view that there are only two sexes, masculine and feminine. Vegetarians defy attempts to hold them accountable to gendered social expectations, she wrote. Women, for example, assert authority over their diets, men embody rejection of the meat masculinity nexus by adopting a worldview that also rejects sexism and racism. On Water's World, Waters challenged her on the claim, and enjoyed a late-night snack during the debate. Delisio Parson said Waters was slightly incorrect when he said consuming meat creates toxic masculinity because the phenomenon is already there. She said it reinforces certain social structures, including patriarchy through its symbolism. Waters then produced some symbolism of his own, as a producer laid a plate of steak, medium rare, in front of him. Is this bad, that I'm eating meat? He asked. Delisio Parson said it would be more acceptable if he hunted or procured the meat himself, rather than enjoying the benefit, with, the blood on someone else's hands. What if you're just hungry, and the animals are there for us to enjoy? He asked. That was the news. We thought you might be interested in knowing about this. Please click, like, and subscribe. Thank you.